Kala you, kill a you. Hmm. Okay. Hello everyone. I'm still exploring Ardon. I did maybe a couple small delve dungeon thingies off stream. Um, just to try to spare you guys some of the monotony of 100% in the zone. I meant to do a bit more, um, just so I can move on to the next zone, but I need to jump down here, don't I? Am I going to survive if I jump down there? Um, but I haven't played the game in a few days, so... I'm still at this stage of things. Oh, woo. I'm scared. Wait, how did that not hurt me? Alright. So we're doing these little, uh... Yeah, we're doing the zone guide. We're just hopping around doing everything at once. Which right now is delves. So delves are nice, but they're probably meant for groups or something. I really don't know. Um, I've been just running in, defeating its boss, and running out. Like, running past everything. Because I don't want to spend 20 minutes in each one. That would be quite a bit of work required. And we just want to finish the zone. Every now and then I start off like I did just now with another person nearby, and that's cool. It means we can get through places quicker. Actually, it looks like there's quite a few people in here. Um, I'm not familiar with these, so usually what I do is I look at the zone. I'm like, okay, I came in here. The boss is probably right here. Right here. That's my guess. It's always like the furthest, hardest to get to place. Ooh, there's bookshelves there. Otherwise, I wouldn't even want to do this fight. Oh man, are they going to skip past? I'll skip that way. Is there one enemy? No, it's several. I don't feel like fighting them. I want the bookshelves, though. But I'm of the mind that the bookshelves probably didn't get any, give anything. Alright. It's been a couple days since I played. I gotta remember how to do it. Alright. I'm still... About a little more than halfway through. Wait, what's this dude? He's got a name. Maybe he's the boss. Yep, that was the boss. Ooh, I gained level 18. Interesting. Ooh. That's a... We'll do that when we're safe. Who the hell's that? Read the inscription. Found the Earth and Mages Guild. That's fine. I'm not really in the mood to pick up extra quests, but you know what? Usually what they give you is just talking to some person in one of the main cities, so it's fine. Ooh, that increased destruction staff. We like that one. And clothing increased. <laughs> well, I guess we get better at wearing clothes, apparently. Like, maybe when you're low level, you put all your clothes on backwards. By mistake, like the band Crisscross, the group. If anyone remembers that. <clears throat> but when you get higher skill level, you learn how to put your pants on correctly and stuff. One leg at a time and everything. Ooh, I want that. While I fight these guys, no, be no one better walk up and take my chest. Marco wrote that. Mm. Basically caused shit for me. 
That's what it said. Ooh, a sky shard. That's another reason these delves are useful. Because of all the, uh, there's some sky shards. I don't think the, uh, Cathari's Roost or whatever, <clears throat> the last zone, didn't have sky shards inside dungeons. So we could complete the zone. I don't even think there were any delves in the last zone. So we are able to complete things without having to do this. But, this time around, we have to go in these, not only to fight the bosses, but to get all the sky shards. Ooh, blueprint. Ooh, I already have that blueprint. I don't know why I'm fighting everything. Like I say, I normally run past them in these places after I've killed the boss just to get out of here. It. We're close to the end. We can do this. I can heal myself while I run. This is no problem. I looked at some housing in this game. <clears throat> Had some really cool houses. But uh, super expensive. I can't get anything I want right now. Not even close. Not even the small houses I can't afford. I can afford the rooms that they have in places. It's always been odd to me how even uh, what's considered large houses in this game are still pretty small. And I wonder why. They're um, independent zones, so I feel like it doesn't have an influence on, like, I don't know. It doesn't seem like lag or anything is the reason why they make them so small. I feel like you can pay a million gold in game <clears throat> and get something that's only moderately large. I want huge estates if I'm paying that much money. Not everyone needs a huge estate, but that's why that only be one type of choice, you know? Uh, do you need to go in here and talk to the person in the city, in the Mage's Guild? <laughs> we gotta do our level up. Alright, so they really want you to get a house at this level, at 18 apparently. So it's for light. A bed would be nice. I think that seems... I think a bed's the greatest necessity there. Oh man, what was I going for? Komodo has a bunch of things I want it. Ooh, summon the winged twilight might be nice. I want a lightning splash, real bad. What does the winged twilight do? Okay, it doesn't have the stun that other one does. It does have a heal though. Because right now I have my heal, which is nice. I have crystal fragments as basically my main damage dealer with crushing shock. Um, and I have my pet and I have boundless storm, which I want to replace boundless storm with lightning splash, but I have to wait two more ranks and then we'll go for this, which is kind of a good little area effect. Um, quite a bit of area effect. And, uh, my Summon Storm Atronach is my main move right now. 
And on this bar, I have my heal again, because that's very important for me to survive. Um, summon minion again. Boundless storm again. Oh, I had... Didn't I have blessing and protection, or was I just wanting that? Ooh, I can get that. That's something I wanted. Okay, yeah, because it's a nice little buff. Like a good little burst heal, too. It's not a regen, really. 2800. Hmm. I want anything on here. Did I get all the uh, ultimates? Yes, and I can even change this to what? Ooh. Man, I don't know. That's very effect. That only increase. The only thing this does is give it four more seconds of existence. Well, I guess if it's dealing 1700 every second, that's like giving it five, six thousand extra damage. This periodically deals extra. Man, I don't know. We'll think about that. I have four points, though. I think I'm definitely going to go for the Blessing of Protection. And I'll probably... Uh, I'll get rid of this stuff for the moment. Storm. I have Boundless Storm on the bar and I have Summon. So I should put Crystal Fragments back on just to gain skill if I switch to it. Alright, so that'll be my healing bar. Man, I, I really want to get that Lightning Splash. That's kind of the only thing messing with my dream right now. I got Boundless Storm in there just to keep it going. Alright. Yes, continue exploring. Ooh, right outside the city I need to go. That's nice. Do I need to feed a boss in there? It just says adventure in it. I think I just need to uh, walk up to it. Maybe we're done with the delves then. And I'm starting to look mage-like. I no longer have that steel helmet on. Alright, let's go talk to this feller. Hey. Hi. Hello there. Are you enjoying the festival? I found this necklace. Does it belong to you? How about you answer a question first? Don't be rude. Little Ozo! You found him! Thank you so much! I don't know how he manages to get so lost. He's the one. Oh, she can summon him with the necklace. That is very strange. Alright. What have we got? Maybe I should start selling in, uh, like, Auction House. Whatever this game's Auction House is called. Start selling stuff there. Um. In order to make more money for our house. Ooh, that's gotta be better than mine. Yep, yep, kinda. It's light, but we want light. 
Because light works with what we got going on. The boots of the twin sisters. That does not work for us. That is nice. I think we're going to go with that. That is also light. That's what we just had, right? No, that's something different. Wait. I don't care. We don't want that. I want to start transitioning, transitioning back into all light gear since I have the skill that helps things from that. This doesn't give me any kind of bonuses, though. What about you? Your stamina? We don't care about you. You're heavy. We don't care about you. I don't really want frost. Don't need shields. We have serums like crazy now. Be your buffs and stuff. Did we look at this already? It's heavy. Heavy. Alright, that's cleaned it out a bit. Is there a merchant around? Where's the auction type things? What are those called? I'll have to look that up. I don't remember. Have I never been down here? Barb Took Tavern has a rented a uh, room to rent in there for like eleven thousand gold. I looked at it. Um, it's it's a tiny tiny room. It's probably not worth it, of course. For me, anyway. Might be nice to put a treasure chest in there and just store stuff. Uh, is that gonna kill me? <laughs> yeah, you saw that? That was that was graceful right there. Really, if I never, I said I've I've checked it out, but I checked it out online. I don't think I've ever. And, oh, that's what it is. It's just showing me room for rent, private room. Let's go to a grocer for a moment. Or, who are you? You're a brewer. I can sell to you. Beer. It brings us yes. Let's sell everything, even though I said I might want to sell everything on a auction house. Beer. It I lied. All right. Mm-hmm. All right, now we got to go back up this way. It's probably going to be a short stream today, even though I haven't streamed the last two days. That's actually the first time in uh, about a month or so I took two days off in a row. I think. Could be wrong, but I think. But I've been uh, pretty busy lately and uh, tired. I'll probably stream for only an hour, hour and a half today. And uh, tomorrow will be Divinity for three, four hours like usual. Oh, I don't even have to. Well. I can't. I might as well just run there, right? There's probably no reason to teleport. Guild traders. Are these basically their auction houses? How may I serve? Very strange. I don't know how it works. Mm-hmm. 
is this? Notifications. Storage has been updated. Where's storage coffer? Fortified collectible. Ah, that's what they gave me for when I leveled to 18. Cool. Yeah, it didn't appear on, uh, at crafting stations, whatever you store in there. So you'd have to take it out. Man, this zone has a lot more quests than the last one. I don't know if I have to do them all to get 100%. to this place before? Is this with the stupid spirits? Wait, what is the game trying to get me to do? Adventure in as a do-in. Do I need to talk to this guy? Sorting the relics, you can begin on the translations. Ooh, bookshelf. Hi. Ah, at last. You must be here with my supplies. Just put the ink and delicate items in the tent here. You can begin unloading the bulk goods with my assistance. Ah, oh, we have an asshole. Sorry, I don't have any supplies for you. What's going on here? Truly, this is the last time I trust an order to that Bosma. It fits, though. His doing has been one disaster after another. First the spirits, now the supplies. And to top it off, my top scholar and her team are missing. Some people are missing? Stars, yes. Undewin and her team are somewhere in the ruins looking for the Malari Mora. They're long overdue. If you're not here with supplies, perhaps you'd go look for them. I'll look for your missing people. Best case scenario, they found the Mora. I don't want to think about the worst case. Too many variables. <laughs> Who are you again? What a curious question. But if you insist, I am Talinger the Artificer, a renowned genius, author, and explorer. As doing is my latest endeavor. I will bring further glory and honor to the Mages Guild. You know, whenever someone claims to be like a genius or something, but then they have to like shove it in everyone's face that they're a genius, it just makes me think they're not a genius. Because they, if they were, they would probably be smart enough to realize that doesn't work and um, it makes people think ill of you. Why are you here? I come in search of the Malori Mora. I'll present it to the council and reap the rewards. Is that the artifact you mentioned? Quite attentive, yes. The Malari Mora is an ancient relic, a talisman. Its power took the lives of everyone here, cursed their immortal souls. The spirits have been here ever since? No, actually. They weren't here when we arrived. Though it's merely conjecture, I believe someone has rediscovered the Mora. The disturbance of the talisman has caused the bound dead to stir. Who is Anduin? She used to be one of my prized students, very accomplished. She's now a high-ranking member of the Mages Guild, the Master of Incunabula. She oversees the Arcaneum in the Skywatch. Inco what? Incunabula. She oversees research and training, a coveted position. One that most of my students aspire to, but few will obtain. What is she doing out here? Assisting me, of course. Ondewan is a true seeker of knowledge. She may care for her books, but research in the field is her first love. Aside from her team, is anyone else out there? Yes, now that you mention it. Sir Inque, one of my students, said something about freeing the spirits. She's nowhere near as analytical as Andewen. I think she's down at our forward camp. I'm sure she's fine. Yeah, she's not fine. We both noticed shit going down somewhere. Forward camp. Where's the forward camp? Because even though they're not sending me there, I have a feeling that she's in trouble. I think maybe we'll just... Ooh, that's her down there. So she looks fine. I won't do that quest unless they make me. If she was in danger, though, I'd save her. The magical lattice can be disrupted, but the underlying problem remains. Well, maybe I should do it. Maybe it works in sync with this one. Fair day. How goes the translations? Wait, you're not one of Tellinger's students. No, I'm not. A fair day indeed. I 
I'm studying the spirits that now haunt these ruins. Nice. I believe they can be released, sent on to their final reward. Perhaps you'd be willing to help with an experiment. I love the sound of experiment, especially when it involves me being an experiment. What do I have to do? Take this crystal. I've etched a series of micro runes onto its surface. Weaken the spirit's hold on the physical world, and then focus your will. That should sever the spirit's hold on Nern. Allow it to pass into Aetherius. I'll give it a try. My talents do not lie in the brute application of spell power. Otherwise, I would be at your side. Field experimentation is fascinating. What was that about my garoons and focus on my will? Much of magic is in the detail. These spirits should not be here. Their presence is inherently fragile. With manipulations of the magicka field around you, your will can carry the punch of a warhammer. Yep. That's been said about my will before. That's the man with the warhammer will right there. Alright, so we need to... Fuck up some spirits and then use that item somehow. Where's my pet? Thanks for not being here. I thought I could count on you. Oh. I like how the spirits scream spread out. Ah. Oh. oh, I can use it. I thought I killed them by mistake. You've lifted my curse. I'm free to seek my rest. All right, we only have to do that nine more times. That's all. Curse. It is gone. I owe you my freedom. Thank you. All right. This isn't too bad. It's on our way to where we're going right there. From the curse of the Malari Mora. What's going on, my friends? Hi. You're not dead. That makes you my new friend. Exactly. That's how friendships work. I make friends with everyone I see that's not dead. Tellinger sent me. Thank the stars for that old man. Canny is hurt, and some of my team members have been taken. We need to get her back to camp. Now that you're here, we can make a break for it. Who took your team members? Some of the spirits appeared, grabbed my researchers, and then vanished. We need to get into the Undercroft. It's the only place I can think they'd be. Is there anything I can do to help? Perhaps. We were out there looking for runes. Combined, these runes form a key. We only need two more. Take a look, and I'll meet you at the entrance of Esduin's Undercroft. I'll get them and meet you there. Black runes? Just any runes? Nope, I need those particular runes. One of them's right past this person. See, this is the typical kind of MMO shit I'm used to. It's only if you do like the 100% 100%ing the zones do you have to deal with it. Otherwise the game doesn't feel much like an MMO. If you just stick to like the main quest lines and mage and fighters guilds and stuff like that. It feels very much like any other Elder Scrolls game. But you do this side stuff. It's like, oh, collect this, free these spirits. I'm like my own worst enemy because I like to 100% everything. Okay, we only have three more of those. Why don't you let me get this thing? There we go. Boom. One more rune. Opposite direction. 
I'm sure we'll fight three more of those enemies on the way. Anytime I see brightly lit blue, I think there's a sky shard. I think perhaps I'm wrong. Hi. Do spirits pick flowers? Because that's what it looked like this one was doing. Maybe he had like a, a sweetheart spirit he was trying to impress. Like that's her favorite flower. Wait, that's a female? Huh. Okay. Point still stands. I don't feel so much stronger this time. Last time I played, I was having a little bit of trouble here and there. Hello, my spirits. One's laying on the ground, just chilling. Speak with you. Meet okay. me at the vault entrance on the ruin's edge. Okay. <sighs> I got two missions. Why is my screen? Oh. This person's attacking me like a jerk. Let me learn this roast venison real quick, dude. Then we shall fight. Still fighting. I guess I'm fighting these guys. I really need to remember how to block. Not remember how to block, but remember to block. Like, for instance, right there would have been nice. ectoplasm don't we so this is the the big quest for the area I don't know about the spirit one might as well pass it up and do the spirit one first perhaps up he wants me to go in there so I guess there's two dungeons in this area because she's over there and this guy is somewhere else drawn back to these ruins just as I felt your touch release them back to Aetherius who are you? I am Quaronadil once a member of the proud Dua family now lashed to the face of Nern by shame I had the misfortune to call Asanyon Dua my brother who is Asanyon? my brother's story is a sad one suffice it to say he is responsible for the trapped souls you see in these ruins his zealotry doomed these souls to eternal torment. Why did you reach out to me? Esduin was home to many powerful mages when I walked beneath the sky. Within this vault lies a magical lattice very similar in function to the crystal you now hold. Only much, much more powerful. Serenku, or however the hell you say it, could use it to free all his spirits then? Just so. There is one obstacle to overcome. A puzzle that defends the ancient mage's spell work. Thirteen tiles surround a chest within. The correct four must be activated to access the lattice. I'm here to help. You must have some idea which tiles to activate. Knowing the mage, I only have my best guess. The tiles represent the great constellations. Mage the Foyer. He held the guardian constellations in high regard. The mage, the thief, and the warrior. Thank you, I'll try those. Good luck, traveler. The lattice may be the last hope for the fallen. 
Why are you helping me? The shame Asanyan brought to my line grounds me to learn. I have hoped for centuries to somehow undo his folly. You're not trapped the way the other spirits are then? No. I saw the growing madness within my brother and had to act. I spoke with the guard of Skywatch, but not in time to save the targets of his zealotry. And not in time to stop the slaughter of every soul in Esduin. You tried to stop him, why are you ashamed? You don't understand. I stood beside my brother for months as the cult grew here. I could have ended his madness at any time. Instead, like a coward, I stayed my hand. Behold the cost. Okay. I probably shouldn't have accepted this Good quest. Luck, Whoops. Uh, because... It's out of the way of the other quest, and I'm not sure it's necessary for the zone. But we've come this far, so we'll finish this one real quick. Oh, luckily it's real small. Man, if I did not have... Persuade, this would be a lot harder, wouldn't it? First thought he saw the path of life, now he talks only of the end of days, he speaks... Of the crow he sees in his dreams. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, we already know that. Thief. So now we just need a warrior. did it. Solve the puzzle. Hint, activate the thief. I got thief, mage, and warrior. Why are we not finished? That's the mage, that's the thief, and that's the warrior. And they're all selected right now. But the puzzle is not complete. What does that mean? Uh, uh, come on, you can jump that. Some mage user you are. I mean, I guess I can activate something else. Maybe that was just a hint, and I didn't... Maybe there's one more. So who's the guardian ones, then? I mean, a tower sounds like a guardian. Uh... The lord could be a guardian. Let's try another one and see if it breaks everything. Did I solve it? It was the tower? Really? You chose wrong. Oh, I was not right. Oh my gosh. So there's four. They only they only give me an idea. That's the mage. That's the thief. That's the warrior. Nothing else sounds even remotely close like it like it's enough. I don't think it's the serpent. The lord, I really don't think that's right either. I think we're gonna get sliced. Ah! Uh, okay. It's time we actually look at stuff. Yeah, that's a thief. I should have looked at this before. That's a warrior. Serpent and mage. So it's a serpent? The serpent's not a guardian. That's stupid. I guess it makes sense why it's in the middle, though. Alright, 
right, this time we got it. Boom. We completed it. First try. No mistakes were made. Fascinating. Indeed. What's going on here? This is a lady that says I can't like go on the field. I don't have the right abilities, and now she's here. Ooh, what's in here? Blueprint. Hell yeah. What's up with you? Serink has a keen mind and a good heart. She's the key to freeing Esduin. Mm-hmm. You've returned, and with the spell lattice. <laughs> I don't know if I'm if I trust these people. See, you've met this guy with the Q name. He came to me and spoke to me about my crystal. When he told me you were retrieving the lattice, I found my courage and followed Quaron out here. You still have the micro-etched crystal I gave you? Yes, what you gonna do? This lattice is an elegant extension of the principles the crystal uses. By enmeshing it within the lattice, it will amplify the power of the crystal. It will free these spirits of the Malari Mora's curse. Cool, here you go. Wish me luck. So they're all stop attacking me, maybe? Look, it's working. Almost Where? We're all gonna die. You did it! I can feel it! They better be friendly. Are you friendly? Hell oh, fucking yeah, I better stay like that. I wanna impact the world. Incredible. Did you see that? Unfortunate that the crystal lattice was destroyed in the process, but it served its purpose well. So it worked? Yes, can't you feel it? The spirits still remain, but in time they will learn they are free to move on. Yeah. Right now, <laughs> how many centuries? Huh, I guess we're not bound here after all. It's like someone's gonna like make a, a quick run to the store and that's when they're gonna realize they're not bound anymore. You know. We need to go get some ghost slime or whatever. Wow, okay, so I guess... I guess I can get rid of Signet. We don't need no Signet of the Worm. Bop, 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 bop. So now we have Magical Recovery. That's what we like. Alright, I hope that doing that quest makes this one easier. Hello, Anduin. I made a bet with Huntherin on the way back to camp. Did you find the runes? I have them. That myrrh owes me five gold. You've done well. Just a moment, and I'll assemble the key. Do you think your researchers are in there? I hope so. If they're not, not worth thinking about right now. How'd they get in there without the rune key, huh? This will be quick. Unlock it. Do it. Come on. There. It's done. Let's go. Let us commence this foolish errand. All this bad shit always happening in ruins. Like I said before. Get rid of all the ruins, you get rid of all the bad shit. In fact, just to be safe, let's demolish every building that's more than 50 years old. Constantly rebuild. Gives people jobs and everything. See? Meldil. Multitasking Thank with my thoughts. Meldil, still alive. Meldil, have you seen the others? Ooh, what's this fancy door? Uh, all these ways to go. What's in here? I don't see any enemies. That means there's treasure. Hello, bookshelf. Give me some skill points. These bookshelves haven't been touched in centuries. 
They should all be glad to give me skill points. I tried to stop him. I couldn't. I couldn't help them. Stop him? Stop who? Uri Kanta. He's here. He's trapped the others. He's using their souls to form the gate. You have to stop him. Who is Yura Cantor? Cantar. He is, was, one of us, one of Tellinger's students. Tellinger cast him out. Uri Cantor is here. He's the cause behind all of this. What gate are you talking about? The one next to us that's glowing? The gate opens onto a shard of Aetherius. Without the soul binding rituals, the gate will close. How can I destroy this gate? Take my amulet. It should let you see, touch, Aetherius. You'll have to make a decision. Break the bindings or kill the students. We're breaking the bindings. Just beware the thirsters. What are the thirsters? And are they thirsty? The overlay with Aetherius has allowed powerful spirits into the Undercroft. They're what brought us down here in the first place. Be careful. If one gets a hold of you, you could get pulled in yourself. So no ghostly hugs. Got it. And a win. to tend to Meldul. We'll move to the room just behind me. We should be safer in there. Where you go, can I ask a few questions? Just leave him on the ground while you answer him. Of course, but speak quickly. Urine Cantor. What is that? Or who is that? It's a name we're all trying to forget. Uri Cantor is very close. Was very close to me. Uh, next. Tellinger cast him out of the guild and forbade him to use magic again. What did he do? He couldn't understand that power has to have limits. That some costs are too high. You can see here what he's willing to do for a taste of power. Ah, so basically a magical sociopath. Meldil mentioned a place called Eretherius, or whatever the hell it is. What is that? How long do you have? I'm sorry, this is just not the place for a protracted metaphysical conversation. It may be enough to say that Aetherius is the spirit realm, the land of the dead. Yeah, he already he also spoke of a shard there. I begin to guess, not without more information, but the use of the Malari Mora, it may have twisted, broken off a part of the spirit world. If a mage were to gain access to such a place, the power, that sounds like Yuri Kantar. Alright, let's go kill Yuri Kantar. Alright, we gotta go down here, right? We got, we got bindings to... Hi. Oh, this is one of those. They're basically traps. <laughs> You look like a ninja. You look like you can accomplish this. Me, however. Guy's gonna drink me up. And there's a lot of students all over the place. I will release your bondage. Please, make it stop. Oh man, do I gotta enter spirit realm and do shit every time? I guess I'll do it. I won't kill him. But I will check this bookshelf. Ooh, they're just... Ah, I can kill those thirsters from this end, I guess. I don't know if it's really gonna affect... things or not. You guys chill for a moment. There's bookshelves to look at. Spirit bookshelves. Apparently spirit bookshelves don't give any stats. Not even spirit stats. Oh hi. Oh wow, I'm back in the regular world. Wait, use the spell to cloak me? That's cool. Don't touch me while look at bookshelves. I'm thinking I'm not going to look at all these bookshelves. There's way too many. See, they're all over the place. Let's 
gonna take me too long. Ah! <laughs> it burns! It burns from inside out! Oh wow. That's why I gotta use protection. Ourselves with an enemy. Took it up my things. I gave him some burn cream. Is there any any guy up in here? Nope. We gotta cut across now. We got two more. Watch my ninja skills. Huh. Yeah. He never knew it hit him. Ooh, look at these guys. They think they're gonna jump me. Spirit realm. Wait, did he actually interrupt this? There we go. I don't need to fight them. I can just let my pet distract him. Boom. And then there's no more fighting. This spell will help you move past the spirits. Cool. I really wasn't having a problem moving past them before. Help me. Will do. Ah. Don't touch me. Yeah, there you go. Mess with my pet instead. Wait, it actually interrupted this though. Uh oh. I think we have to kill him. Everyone's getting electrified. How does it feel? Boom, that's what I thought. done. Does that bookshelf got anything? Of course not. Out of my way. We. Ah, we got them all back to life. We could have killed them all and told her, oh, well, there's nothing I could have done. Oh, we already checked all these. I know what room this is. By the light of Uriel, you've returned. Your Encantar's plan has failed. You are a capable sort. Stars guard your steps. I'm going to get us out of here. Put a stop to this madness. Find Urikantar and end him. I'll deal with your Encantar. She'll kill him. Where's the inner sanctum at? Oh, you mean the glowy place. Got it. Knocky knock. Ah, Talinger's latest. Hello, you're in Cantar. Hold a moment before we continue the game. Yeah, I'll be reading all these books. Nothing here, really? Oh, clothing, cool. Now I know how to put my my pants on correctly again. You can hear my uh, pet getting pretty impatient with me taking so long. Ooh, what's over this way, dude? Wait, that's the inner sanctum? Oh, that's right, because he's not here. This is just a projection. What is this? I'm gonna read the journal. I'm gonna read about that time someone bullied you. Or that time you got dumped. Let's see. Still nursing the wounds inflicted by his teacher. I was certain we would spend centuries together, she and I. All she had to do was acknowledge my power and recognize that telling Gur's time has passed. Explored the surface ruins and found my way past the ancient magic to protect the ruins' interest, uh, entrance. Uh, spirits don't bother him for some reason. He found the Malari Mora lying where it had fallen. Uh, 
He made all the spirits come into being again. Which basically was his way of announcing to the world people were screwing around down here. He figured out how to use it all. Mm, he has guardians and stuff, yeah. Yep. He's a jealous jerk. What up? The old Mur and I have played the game for some time now. So sad to see another soul caught between us. I've come for the Malari Mora. Of course you have. He can't possibly let me go. Can't possibly let me succeed. It no longer matters. After you're dead and gone, I'll find new vessels. Draw forth the power I need from them. I don't plan to die. And I hadn't planned to be here. I planned to take over from the old Mur and perform the life binding with Aunt Derwin. Instead, look at me. This is my last chance for a legacy to own and control a shard of the Arthur. Hand over that crap, or I'll have to take it. I wouldn't it. have it any other way. Come, let's see which of us lives to tell this tale. Oh man, you hear that? I better practice my my tale telling. I'm gonna slaughter all your peoples. Is that the way out? Thunder Mall. You and your fancy name. I'm gonna go sit over here and have a have a, a bit of stew. Maybe drink a little broth. Oh, is this a journal? It's that time you you wet your bed when you were twelve. I'm not reading all this. Oh, that's the other dude's journal. See, we know about that from the other quest, so I guess the other quest was worth it. And that's Yurikantar dead on the ground. I guess someone else came in here and killed him. What's on this table? And you guys let me get awfully close. Hi. I knew I was coming. Why do you let me get that close? Man out. Man out. Ooh, there's one down. Barely even took any damage. Thunder Maul. Boink. All right. Well, I'm gonna have to tell that tale to everyone, since I've lived to tell it. Look, you're so bad that you have corpses in two places. E. What I get. I don't need no linen breeches. Nickel, obsidian, I don't need any of that. Mm -hmm. Nah. Okay. Tellinger is going to be right outside. You know, I built up the courage to come here myself. These spirits, yeah, still friendly, good. Wait, are they? Yeah.
So I guess that quest was worth doing just to make these guys not attack anymore. Ah, I thought I was clever. Tellinger didn't say anything, but I can tell. He's disappointed. I'm going to spend the entire trip home asking the stars how to get back into his good graces. I do like how there's some closure with the quests. I've already written home to my parents. I'm not quitting. I just need a short break. Stars keep you. I think Canny will be all right. We saved all these people. Some of these. I'm feeling a bit nervous after my brush with death. I bet I'd have been a lot more nervous in an urn, though. Yeah, but you're not a very good maid, so if you ended up in an urn, it would have been something you earned. I prayed for your safe return. It's good to be out under the open sky again. I hope. I hope Uri Kantar went down without much struggle. Yeah, I mean, he wasn't very good, so... He definitely went down without much struggle. I already checked that bookshelf. Hi. You return. I'm almost afraid to ask, but what news? Urin Kintar is dead, and I have the Mallory Mora. Remarkable. I'm not easily impressed, but you've done it. And Yuri Kantar disappoints to the bitter end. Such a waste. I'm glad I was here to help. You may even say I was better than you. All that remains is to tend to the wounded and continue the research. With the Mora in hand and Uri Kantar dead, his doing will soon be at peace. I'll see to it. Hmm, that's a lightning staff. It adds spell damage, but it's really not good for me. All right, we're done with that quest. I know I didn't complete the zone. You're gonna ask me if I want to continue. Wow, why didn't it ask me to complete? I see I got all this to do. I got like 11 more there, three there. This is gonna take absolutely forever. I'm going to have to do a lot of this off stream just so it doesn't get too monotonous. All those books, sky shards. Ooh, man. Ah, I'm not doing all the world bosses. Not unless I get there and there's already a ton of people there. That's not happening. Uh, explore zone. What's next? Where am I? Okay, we're not that far away. Out of my way, campfire. Let that be a lesson to you. Don't stand on my grass. is this? Heck are you? Heck a shattered groove. Just need to find a way up. Alright. 
a lot of people hanging out here for some reason. Yeah, I'll look everywhere for books. I don't have to return here later. Mm. Hello, sir. I have heard that your groove is shattered. Hmm? Oh, a living person. You should probably get clear, living person. It's not safe in this part of Oridon. You are the second person to address me as a living person. What's going on here? Well, surrounding you is a town full of statues. It's problematic. Can I help you somehow? Hmm? Who are you? Wait. Not important. You're new, and not a statue. I can use that. What happened to all these people? Ah, yes, uh, I did it. I turned them to stone, but for a good reason. It was the only way to protect them from the savage beasts. What savage beasts? The animals here are normally very tame. Energies in the wood. Now they're vile and bloodthirsty. I believe they've been possessed by Daedra. Why did you turn the people into statues, though? I lost some of my apprentices to the beasts, so when I made it back to town, I cast a spell that would protect everyone. It was the only way. All right, then. How do we fix this? As long as those creatures prowl the woods, we're in danger. I believe the monoliths in the woods have something to do with the Daedric influence. Dispel their energies. Hopefully that will free the animals. Here's another guy. I know how to turn everybody into statues, but I can't. Dispel energy some for some reason. I must have someone else do it for me When the Daedric influence is gone, it should be safe to restore the village my poor neighbors Where did the Daedric influence come from I don't know I don't know the beasts are insidious and we Altmer never bargain with Daedra Hmm never to even consider summoning one of those monsters <laughs> It'd be inviting a death sentence. The Atronox, at least. They're more constructs than... No, a death sentence. What are these monoliths you mentioned? They're ancient. I've studied them for years in my spare time. Not even really sure who put them up. But I'm certain they're why the local creatures are normally so docile. So the Daedric influence is in these monoliths? Ah, yes. I theorize that wherever the Daedra came from, they're somehow polluting the energy of these monoliths. Dispel that energy and, I hope, the Daedra will become powerless. All right, will do. It's all this way, eh? What was that? Blacksmith station. We've never been there before. find it interesting you know why we did that no reason all right look at that bear he's not happy look at that wolf not happy and there's a monolith so a monolith over here Hello, pissed off monolith. Boom. I'm gonna win the dispelling bee when this is done. Sky shard. Hell yeah. What's this place? Oh, that's the dude we just saw. This is his tower. We know he's not home. Let's loot his treasures. Watch me find something that implicates him as, like, a bad guy or something. Hmm. Armor trait, huh? I really do want to get into crafting someday. I just know it's going to be such a time sink, and it's not really something I could spend a ton of time on the stream doing. 
Wait, forbidden research notes? Where do I see that at? We got an alchemy station. I don't have anything else to use, really. Where do I see forbidden research notes at? Still, so mostly, almost mobile and still resemble wolves, mostly. So he created it. He was fucking around and he messed it up. It's top floor, huh? We're gonna get down to, down, down to, uh, we're gonna get to the bottom of this. That's what I meant to say. Crafting motif, hell yeah. Oh wow, 125 new collectibles unlocked. I have no idea what I just did. Spoiled food, he hasn't been here in a while. Can't go in that door. No longer welcome into college. Ill-advised experiments. Ooh, Tellinger, we know who he is now. That's one good thing about the, uh, the story quest though. They all tie together, I really like that. Now we know who he worked with and everything. We also know that Tellinger dismisses a lot of his students. And maybe if he didn't dismiss so many people and he instead spent the time to teach them what's right and wrong, we wouldn't have these problems. Hmm. Kinda need this. We're gonna lose some experience, but we do what we can, you know? All right. I bet you I can't jump on out down there without dying. So we know that the guy who wants us to go dispel energies probably caused those energies to begin with. <laughs> And yet it's kind of cool because we could have very easily passed it up and never known. Alright, that one is done. There's a lot of these beasts around. We only have one more. Did I get that waypoint? Yes, I did. Who the hell is this dude? Oh, he's gonna come back when we do this, isn't he? Maybe not. I sense the field disperse. I would speak with you. You're bad. The energy subsides, but the animals are still savage monsters. We'll have to try something else. We need a bear. What now? I've spent some time studying these monoliths. I've managed to create a little magical fob that imitates their energy. Essentially, it will make one of the earth signs your furry friend. For a time. Why do I need a furry friend again? I need to... We need to extract the Daedric energy from these beasts. To do that, we'll need a test subject. You'll have to rough the furry fellow up a bit first. Weaken him for the spell to work. Uh, we've seen that before. All right, I'll collect a bear for you. Meet me at my tower with your friend. Just follow the road through the grove. We've been to that tower before. And we know that he needs the bear for a bad reason. Oh, shit. Do not fight me. Wait. Hi, bear. No, I got out of your freaking cone. Yeah. All right, let's go. Uh, shit. Let's go. Ah, good. 
Now let's see if I can banish the Daedric influence from this creature. I'm gonna have to kill this guy, aren't I? Yep, he's not Daedric anymore. He's also dead and on fire. That should not have happened. Huh. This will not do. Something here is very wrong. Let me guess, you need a wolf now? What was that? A flame atronach. My spell should have sent it screaming back to oblivion. But something else interfered. There's a powerful Daedra nearby. I know it now. You have to kill it. I have to kill it? Do you have any idea where it is? A moment. I can feel something. There's a cave north of here. Whatever this monster is, dispatch it, and we can return the grove to peace. I'll meet you back in town as soon as I'm done. I'm dispatching it. And then I'll dispatch you. Alright, north, huh? Which fucking way is north that way? Well, it's kind of a distance away. Dodge all these stupid animals. Stealth, not me. I'm stealthy by nature. Oh, it's her. We saw her at the other quest. See, it's it's all combined. I like that. It's all continuous. Stay back. This cave is filled with Daedra. I know. Who are you again? Meromo leaves me here to die, and he doesn't even mention me. Stars take him. I'll kill that traitor twice. I'm pretty sure it's the same lady from other quests. She wasn't this, uh, vengeful last time. Traitor, what are you talking about? This debacle is all Moromo's fault. These beasts, controlled by Daedra? All his idea. He was trying to create animal soldiers. Feigned shock troops with the ability to reason. We knew that. It hasn't gone very well. No, it hasn't. Look. Whatever's actually controlling these things, I think it's at the bottom of the cave. I'm very woozy. Blood loss. I'll stay here. Try to stay conscious. And I'll take care of Papa Master. Be right back. Hi, dude. Hello. Hello. These Atronachs are on fire. This bitch is on fire. Alright. I'm curious if I... I'm still gonna have to fight him from where I am. Or are you gonna run away? Am I really gonna have to fight them all? Because that's not happening. I'll tell you that right now. I repent. I repent. I got this. Uh oh. Hello, pet. All right, I'll kill this thing real fast. It doesn't help that my, uh, my staff is a, is a fire staff. Uh oh. It's okay. I got another one. I can do this all day. Gonna be front running out again. Boom. All right. That worked out perfect. We weren't ever in danger. Yeah. 
hide helmet, huh? Nope, don't need it. All right. Now we need to run out. Oh, hopefully he cleared the way. Yeah. Good man, good man. He didn't take the lazy, crazy approach like me. All right, you you still conscious? Oh, look, you're standing and everything. I heard. I heard the battle. Impressive. I assume you won. <laughs> no, I lost, and I'm now dead, and you're talking to someone who just looks alive. The beast is dead. Can you walk? Stars, yes. Let's get that bastard. Marormo needs to pay for what he's done here. All right. Let's confront this person. This direction. Hey, look, they're not enemies anymore. I'm slowly making areas safe in this zone for myself. Man, he does not like that rock at all. Wait, is this the tower? It certainly does not look like a tower. This looks like town. Oh, right. He's in the middle of town again, isn't he? All right. Make this place not stone. Damn it, Moromo! You coward! Statues? Restore them now! I... I'll, uh... uh of course. Uh... Now, to make sure you don't teleport away. <laughs> that could have been animated better. But a moment. Oh, that's the cannon reef. Do any of these people even know they were ever statues? What does she want to say? What? What just happened? The animals of Grove grew violent. To protect the village, Meromlo turned everyone to stone. He did what? Why would he do that? Oh. Let's see what he has to say first. Listen. You can't tell the Cannon Reef. She'll kill me. I'm not. I'm not joking. She'll have me put to a blade. Explain yourself. Why do all of this? My nephew, Yander, went off to join the fighting and... Damn it, I just wanted to stop spending our blood. My sister will never be the same. How can Daedra ever save lives? It's not just the Daedra. It's the monoliths. I've studied them for years worked out how the magics pacify the beasts. But that's all the magic does. It turns beasts into mewling pets, not combat troops. So did Daedra were to control animals through the monoliths? Yes. The flame atronachs are essentially just raw Daedric energy given form. I summoned some, hauled them down, and poured them into the monoliths. That creature in the cave was not in the plan. Thank you for being honest, I guess. What do you think? Don't listen to what that traitor said. Tell the Cannon Reeve. Man, she's... <sighs> Please, think before you make your decision. He didn't want his... He didn't want troops to die, so he risked everyone else. What? Man. What? Alright. He did what? Why would he do that? Oh, man. If this... See, this is a true statement. But I don't know if he should die. This is not so much uh, true. I mean, it is also a true statement, but it's... The truth lies more with this one. But then again, he was also kicked out of school for doing experiments he shouldn't. Man, I'm gonna let him live, though. Hmm. Mages. Fine, fine. Thank you for speaking with me. I'll kill him myself if I have to one day. Oh man. There she is over there. I wanted to see if she pouted. How could you side with that traitor? Unbelievable. Man, she was so nice in the last quest. If if that's the same person. Thank you. I heard what you said and thank you. I meant it. You were trying to save lives, right? I never meant for anyone to get hurt. And the lesson here is clear. Daedra are never the answer. I'll never attempt this kind of ritual again. 
You probably hear this kind of thing all the time, but again, thank you, traveler. Look at us. We're nice. We're so nice. Yeah, a save Shattered Grove. So if I hadn't done that quest, these this would have always been a town that didn't have any kind of activity. But now there's happenings. I do like how I can change the oh, world, at least the save the queen, eh? for myself. You don't look that special. I didn't just save the queen, I also saved you, jerk face. You've been standing in a stone for a long time. Alright, where is it wants to go next? I don't think we're going to do it tonight. But it's good to know. I need to turn around completely as usual. So, basically, I'm going to get us there. And then uh, I'm going to leave for tonight. It's only been an hour and a half. I know it's a short stream, but... I'm pretty tired, and I'm pretty hungry. I've not eaten yet. But um, tomorrow, I'll be on for the usual divinity with uh, with friends. And uh, I did miss streaming on Monday. I think it was Monday, which was not originally in the cards. So I probably will throw in. I'll try my best to stream either Friday or Saturday. Um, more likely Saturday. Maybe Friday night. And then Sunday will be more Divinity. Because I actually want to make a lot of progress in this game. But I might have to... Uh, I might have to end this whole goal of 100%ing all the zones. Because I can easily pour... Another 20 30 hours in each zone, probably trying to do all this stuff. Or if I do do it, maybe I'll do a bit of it off stream, like I said before. Am I can I not get into this area? There's a little road here, but we came from that direction. How do I get there? Favorite dish? Hmm. I don't know. I'll, basically, if it's unhealthy, I like it a lot. And if it's healthy, I don't. Hey, cool. I found a way in. Uh, I like pizza a lot. I like uh, catfish. I like... Uh, what is this? Where does this lead to? Oh, that's where I was supposed to enter at. I see. Instead, I just leap the wall. Pizza, catfish, sandwiches, usually like uh, my preferred sandwich meat is turkey. I like chicken a lot. I like... Ooh, sky shards. I like sky shards. Actually, that's not a sky shard. It looked like one, and instead, now I'm fighting wolves. I like hamburgers and fries and stuff a lot. You know, if I had to pick something probably eat the rest of my life, though, it'd probably be, like, stews and stuff. Not necessarily, not necessarily soups, but, like, uh, roast or, um, you know, roast potatoes, carrots, things like that. Red beans and rice are good, but I'm from... In the south in the United States, so red beans and rice is kind of a staple. What about you? What's your favorite dish? What kind of mage's guild is this? This looks like a mage guild that like broke apart and now there's people here that shouldn't be or something. Stripped of all titles, duties, and rights accorded to him by his position. I think I've seen that name before. And the queen. 
It's not like that fellow. And I feel like I should recognize the name. go in the lair. I guess we're not really supposed to be right here. I think we're supposed to be doing something out here. Yeah, I like Italian food a lot. Spaghetti and stuff. Mean potato is really good. I've been wanting to uh, use slow cooker a bit more because I haven't done it in years. And I just haven't done it recently either. Like I, I keep saying I'm going to and then I haven't. Ooh, you want that? That's a good one. All right. Where does it want us to go? Usually when it sends you to a place, there's a quest there. This is the only place. I feel like there was supposed to be something in there, but maybe the, it got killed or something. I don't know why I'm going back and forth. This is a really long loading screen. <laughs> if there's nothing in here, I'm still going to stop here. Look at all these people. They're trying to figure out what the hell to do, too. I mean, I found his damn lair. I just can't go in it. Cannot use that door right now. Ooh, that looks like a place we can get up to. Probably treasure up there. Usually there's a door that lets you go in the second floor. I don't see it though. Oh well. I'm gonna end it here and uh, I'll be back tomorrow night. Have a good night. See you next time.